Dude, oh my god, did you see that Modern Warfare 3 trailer, dude? That game is gonna be freaking amazing. It's going to be better than freaking Resistance 3, freaking, free, freaking Gears of War 3, freaking Battlefield 3, Uncharted 3. It is not going to be better. Y'all should have known I was on the second I said Battlefield 3. And I know it ain't going to be better than greatness known as Uncharted. But, anyways, um, this is going to be my impressions of uh, the Modern Warfare 3 trailer. Another Call of Duty. How phenomenal, right? <laughs> Here we go again. Anyways, my impressions of the Modern Warfare 3 trailer that was just released like a day ago. And it, only, and it already has like 4 million something... Call of Duty will never die. Uh, like, you can get a black box and just put the word call of and not even put the last word duty. Just just put call of. I guarantee you it gets sales. <laughs> um but yeah, so my impressions. Um first off, I have to say this. Uh I'm shocked by what's going on how much hate this trailer is getting. Um normally this is how the Call of Duty phase works out and let me know if I'm lying. They announce a new Call of Duty. People rejoice. They're like, oh my god, dude, yeah, pre-order. I can't wait for this game. They show the trailer. People are like, oh my god, this trailer looks, looks freaking sick. This is, gonna, this is going to be the best Call of Duty ever. I cannot wait for this game. Right, right? The game releases. Everyone buys it. Even the people who said they're not buying it, they buy it because they don't want to feel left out. You know, for the, the first month, you know, pe people are like, oh my god, this is the best Call of Duty ever. Like, I love this game. Two to three months later, it seems like everyone hates the game. That's normally how the Call of Duty phase works out. Let me know if I'm lying. If I'm lying, I'm flying. So, that's why I was shocked when I seen that the trailer was getting more hate than I thought it would. But, I think this is, this is what's going on. The Battlefield 3 fanboys are watching this trailer and they're like, this game has nothing, absolutely nothing <laughs> on Battlefield 3. Because Battle, Battlefield 3 does look good. And, you know, the Call of Duty fanboys are, uh, of course, trying to stick up for their title. And they're like, dude, screw you, get out of here. And the Homefront fanboys are just there, like, watching. Because, <laughs> listen, I don't know if Homefront sucks or not because personally I've never played it. But I have friends who have this game, and every single one of them hates the game. I don't know how Homefront is, but um, what what I'm hearing of it, it sucks. But I can't say it sucks because I've never played it. But it seems like that's what's going on, you know, just fanboys going at it. Um, but I have to say, after me watching the trailer for like three 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 times now, you know, I rewatch it just to you know get get the thoughts fresh in my mind of what I think about this trailer. I have to say this. Uh, this is not me, me being biased because, you know, a lot of people think that I hate Call of Duty. I don't hate Call of Duty. If you have me added on PSN, you even see me playing Call of Duty a lot, you know, and people will always send me, mes send me messages like, you're playing Black Ops? And I'm like, it has the word black in it. I'm black. I have to support it. No, but seriously. <laughs> um, so, I don't hate Call of Duty. I just hate how people, um seem to think it's the best thing since fried chicken like they seem to think it's the best shooter ever it's not the best shooter ever and i know for a fact it's not better than fried chicken that's just my opinion um well actually that's a fact <laughs> but um so i don't hate call of duty it's just in my opinion it's not the best thing ever um but i can say this after after watching the modern warfare 3 trailer you know multiple times i have to say nothing i saw shocked me nothing amazed me I said, same old, same old. I was like, oh, here we go again. I even was yawning during the trailer, like dead serious. And this is why I say this. If you haven't seen the Modern, the Modern Warfare 3 trailer, watch it. If you have seen it, stick with it, brother. Listen to what I'm about to say. Okay, so the trailer, we've all seen the trailer. Now look at the Call of Duty 4 trailer. Look at the World at War trailer. Look at the Modern Warfare 2 trailer. Look at the Black Ops trailer. Let me know if every Call of Duty trailer that has that we have seen does not consist of these four things. Gunshots, epic music playing in the background, a lot, a lot of explosions and things breaking and things falling over, you know, helicopters, airplanes, buildings, all of the, all that good stuff. And um, last but not least, that voice that I've been hearing since Call of Duty 4, I don't know what his name is, um... But I've been hearing that same voice in the, you know when you start up Call of Duty, of Duty 4 and um, it's that, 
is that guy talking and he's like, they have come and killed us, but we will try to, I, I, I don't know what his name is, but I've been hearing him since Hall, I don't know if his voice is engraved into my brain, but it seems like every trailer has a voice talking in the background. And Modern Warfare 3 had those same exact things, explosions, all this stuff going on, and epic music, gunshot, it just, every single Call of Duty trailer has done the same thing, and Modern Warfare 3 did nothing different, that's why I said I saw the same old, same old, um, that's just my opinion, the only thing in this trailer that had, that had me like, ooh, yay, was, um, when I seen the AC-130 part, see, it seems like the AC-130 is going to be back, cause you know, AC-130 was one of my favorite kill streaks in Modern Warfare 2, um, they showed a quick clip of it where you was using the AC-130 to destroy a building, I guess. Um, it seems like you you can drive now in this one. I'm not sure if it's going to be in the online part. If it is, the Battlefield fanboys are going to be like, way to steal from us. <laughs> they're, they're, you know, they're trying to find everything they can to bring down this game. But it seems like you can drive now. I'm not sure if it's going to be an online or just campaign, but... um. Are they stealing from Battlefield? Uh, I'm not even going <laughs> to... I, I don't want to say nothing about it. Um, but as far as what I think of this trailer, nothing new. I've been around this road before. I've seen that same building. I've seen these same trees. Just to give you guys some type of analogy. Right. I've seen, I've seen this before. And I know what's going to happen. Um... This Call of Duty trailer is, it seems like I've seen, I, I've been through this story before. I've been here before. That's just my opinion of uh, the trailer. Um, let me know what you guys think of it, whatever. Um, and as always, I greatly appreciate if you rate the video. It doesn't have to be a thumbs up. It could be a thumbs down. But what I ask every brother and every sister is to just be <laughs> So until then, I'll catch you on my next one, alright? Peace.